Step one, pop the hood. Once we've got our lighting established, first thing is to drain the oil pan. You'll have to find what bolt you need. So uh, here's our oil pan right here. So this bolt, that's the 9 16th bolt right there. So what we have to do is drain this into uh, this thing. I dropped the bolt. I got it. Okay, don't do that. If you do that, make sure you have a magnet tool thing to uh, retrieve it. All right, uh, you do wanna make sure there's no uh, metal on this little magnet area. If there's metal filing, that means your engine's falling apart. That's not good. Basically get it as tight as we can. Okay, so now that we got the bolt fished out and back in, now we can change the filter. Okay. This part's not very fun in the Lexus. Most cars are not this difficult to get to. My oil filter is basically middle bottom of the engine. So it's kind of right behind the radiator fan. Not a great spot. This thing is really nice for removing the filter. I don't know how I would do it otherwise. Do not use this to try to put on the filter. You will uh, break your new filter and it won't end very well. You wanna get something jammed underneath the filter to catch most of the oil. Well, you can latch that chain around the filter. That's all you need. All right, now we're listening. Excellent, okay, now it's I can loosen it with my hands. And this is the messy part. Uh, always make sure you have something underneath to catch it if you don't want your garage floor to be a mess. I'm gonna try to catch it in this shop towel. It's gonna be a messy ordeal no matter what. All right. There's the filter loose. Let's see if I can grab it without it going upside down. So awkward. There we go. And that's an oil filter. Right, so just cleaned where the uh, old filter was and uh, not too bad at all. So that's mostly clean. This is the easy part, putting in the new filter. So this you just kind of go by feel. It takes a while to get used to. You just have to get it hand tight. It's a long bolt that it goes on to. All right. Yeah, it's as tight as I can get with the hands. So it's good to go. Now we just put in some more oil. I switched over to high mileage at about 420,000 kilometers and uh, it's burning down even more than it used to. So this crap doesn't work. So I'm switching back to the normal stuff as soon as I'm out of it. All right, so got the bolt on the bottom. Taking out the old oil, close that back up, taking off the old filter, put on the new filter with everything drained, and then filled up the system with new oil, and now the engine is full of new oil. All right, so we are ready to start the engine. So the oil light came on for like two seconds as the engine circulated the oil, and then came off, so we're good to go. 